I think earlier this week at the board meeting, you know, the the uh, a new position or position was presented to the board, and the bottom line is that I will resign as athletic director at the end of this school year and assume a position as an administrative assistant, which will allow me to coach football and continue a lot of the same duties that I've been doing, but in, in more of a, a, an advisory and helpful manner than actually being the athletic director. So I'm excited about that going forward. I think it's a win-win for Conway, and it's a win-win for me. Now, why did this come about? Is it because of the misfortunes of the team the past few years? No, it's it's really not football related. It's just got a lot to do with the athletic director's job, to be honest with you, because the job has become very big. It, it, it's grown over the years tremendously. As I look at my career as an athletic director and the degree to which it's grown and, and the uh, paperwork that's required, and et cetera, it's become extremely cur cumbersome. and. It will be a, a, a breath of fresh air for me not to have to deal with a lot of those things during football season. And I think at the same time, uh, some of the attention that I can give that position during football season is tough. So having an athletic director, whether it be uh, someone that's well versed in, in this area or somebody brand new, it will be a great help having some more help in that area. And how many sports do you oversee? Well, there's actually 46 different sport teams that answer to the athletic office here at Conway High School. Now, some of those are middle school teams, but and some of them are junior varsity, and some of them are B-squad teams. So there's a lot going on. The biggest thing is the management of, of the people. You know, you've got probably 70 different coaching positions that you manage, and that is, is, is quite a lot of work. And so I'm looking really forward to being able to spend more time with football doing the things that, that I really enjoy doing. And, and again, from a Conway High School perspective, I think that, that they're going to come out ahead just because we'll have two people doing those, doing those jobs. And, and obviously, it'll be hopefully the job will be done better. 32 years here, 260 career victories, winning as coach ever on the Grand Strand. How long are you going to keep doing this as the head coach? Well, Hags, you know, I'm not as old as you, so uh, I feel like I got a few more years to go. And you know, as a head coach, it's hard to say. Uh, honestly, I love what I do. I feel like God called me to do this. And as long as I feel called and have a job, I'm going to continue to do it. Uh, now, at the point that, uh, that I no longer feel that calling, then I'll, I'll address it at that point in time. But right now, I'm coaching the Dagum Conway Tigers, and that's what I intend to do.